my love welcome back to another video thank you so much for tuning in i am zuki for those who don't know when last did i say that anyways we are not there welcome back to my channel um we are vlogging today i need to go pick up a few hygiene items so i decided obviously i am bringing you along with me um it's that time of the month and I don't have some of my items so I need to go to the mall I don't have a choice I was dragging my feet but I have to because another reason why I have to go to the mall is because I have my appointment today for my contraceptives so the clinic is at the mall so I need to go pick up my new stock I've been also delaying that <laughs> yeah um i am literally on the last pill today so i woke up early because my appointment is at quarter to one and i am going this early it's around 10 o'clock i need to leave because the load shedding is at 12 o'clock and i'm not sure if the clinic has a generator they should but I, I don't know i'm not sure so i don't want to risk because i don't have a pill for tomorrow so yeah it's that kind of a situation i'm risking i know but then yeah you'll understand in my other video why i couldn't go get my polls um it's not an excuse but it's an excuse so yeah so yeah um that's another reason why we're going to the mall we need our contraceptive pills and yeah we just need my hygiene items so quickly let's open my list so we are on a budget i am not planning on going to the mall and buying unnecessary things so i wrote a list usually i don't write a list i hardly write a list when i go to the mall so this time we wrote a list hygiene items so the first thing um sanitary pads i need a pack um panty liners wet wipes feminine wipes a toothpaste and also a toothbrush i need a new toothbrush um eyelash brushes because i want to do a diy lash extension at home so hopefully i can get those small brushes you use for your eyelash extensions i'm looking for those brushes um i know i can get them at china mall but i'm not going anywhere close to china mall so hopefully i can get them at the chinese stores in the mall so yeah i also need a mouthwash body butter or body lotion or both because i really like the body butter from bramley from pip if i can get both it would be great but for now i just need one of the two um and then i also need tissues so sorry these are the items I need to go get at the mall. So let's not waste any further time because I'm on a time crunch because of load shedding. So let me go to the mall and then I will come back and do a haul of the items that I picked up. So I will see you guys at the mall. And as I always say, if I cannot vlog properly at the mall where I show my face, then I will just do a montage of me getting the items because honestly, it's very difficult vlogging at the mall. The moment they see a camera, I remember, I think this was, uh, I think it was December, yeah, I was doing my vlogmas, yeah, it was December, I was doing my vlogmas and I remember walking into this cam. A different disc came than the one I'm going to today. I remember walking into this cam and I was in one of the aisles and the security from a distance just saw a camera. And the camera was facing me by the way. The security just saw a camera and they quickly came to me and told me no video rising on um no no visualizing in the store so vlogging with a camera is very difficult and i just took off my phone because it's a phone you cannot tell me what to do with my phone so so i will do that if i cannot vlog with a camera i will just take out my phone and and do 
I cannot speak. I will just take out my phone and do a montage of me getting the items that we need. So yeah, I will see you guys at the mall. I've been speaking. I will check you guys at the mall. All night. All night. All night. All night. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since we last kicked it. And by the way, just got in town. And I won't let you in this club. It's all in the sky. Ruin my vibe. Usually, I don't do this often. But since we So I started in the deodorant aisle. I am currently on a hunt for a new deodorant. I think I might have a problem with the one I'm using. Currently I am using a spray. I will show you in one of my self care vlogs. Currently I am using a spray. So I was trying to decide do I want to continue using a spray. It is a Nivea spray. So do I want to continue using a spray or do I want to go back to using a roll-on but then i decided i'll think about it um let me continue getting the items that were on my list So as I turn around, I noticed the nails and I must say, Kiss has beautiful nails. Even though it's really out of my budget, I don't see myself buying nails for 200 or 190 press on nails, by the way. But these are really beautiful nails and I really loved the ones I was checking out. They look so nude, they look so natural and I really like the look of them. The next up, I went to my appointment. I'm a 
I cannot decide between the two. Um, even though I'm leaning more towards this one, I think I want to take this one. But I also want this one. Speaking of a person who cannot decide, let's see. Okay, um, okay, I've decided. Okay, so we have pantaliners, we have sanitary pads, we have wet wipes, we have feminine wipes we have a toothbrush and a toothpaste mm -hmm. we have a mouthwash we have this we have that so we just need to get eyelash brushes hans has 50 percent off but they don't have any more stock of the items so i think i'll just get this um thing Okay, thank you very much. I'll take it. It is. Thank you very much. Um, so, um, this one is 50 rand, meaning I'll buy it for 25 rand. So, I think I will take two of that. And then the micellar water is 50. I was gonna take, I think I want this one because I don't want the mattifying one, I want the hydrating the cream gel. I think I'll take this one. Hey my love, so I'm back with a haul of the items that I picked out. We were on budget. We were on budget. We were following the list of the items that we need to get until until I went to the skincare section at Discam. That's where everything went south. That's where we went over budget. I wasn't planning. I wasn't planning on getting skincare items, but yeah, it happened. So let's start with clicks. But before I start with clicks, in case you want to know, since we are dealing with feminine hygiene things, um, the brand that I have been, I'm on the pole, and the brand that I have been using is No Debt, and it's been working out for me, really working out. What's the coincidence of me needing to go to the mall to buy hygiene items while me being on my period and me having an appointment? Wow, okay, okay, okay. Anyways, um, yeah, I've been using the Nodet brand and it's been working out for me. Even though at first, when I started, we've been having issues with my weight I was really gaining a lot of weight but right now it seems like my weight has regulated um, I'm at a good place with my weight we are okay with the weight for now the only problem is headaches I get migraines almost every single day morning and night that's my struggle right now 
and also recently recently in this past month or two months or so i've been noticing because this used to happen when i started using the pill but then everything was normal i've been getting nauseous a lot i'm not pregnant don't worry i'm not pregnant no i'm not <laughs> so i've been getting very nauseous a lot i think it's because because i used to take the pill in the evening and that was after i've had something to eat but now i changed to taking it in the morning so that i can take it with vitamins in the morning but i've noticed that i take it at eight o'clock so that's before i have anything to eat so I've been thinking maybe I should go back to taking it in the evening because it's really making me nauseous. Like it's really making me nauseous. Like to the point where um, I can want to eat something but because of the nauseous, I just don't want to eat it after that. And then I get hungry. So it's been giving me struggles in the last month or so. So I think I need to change my times of taking it. I don't know why it's becoming a problem again. But yeah. Anyways, let's go back to the haul of the items that we picked out. So, first things first, I picked out these panty liners from the Stay Free brand. And as you can see, uncensored. The moment my items are censored, then we are going to have a serious problem. So, I always make sure that my items are uncensored. And that pack... We have 76 panty liners in the pack. That pack was around 45, 46, which I think it's a good deal. So yeah, decided to try that one out. As you saw, I took the blue lotion, but then I decided let me rather take this one because this one is for very dry skin. And I have very dry skin. So what I do is that I mix this lotion with my Bradley Magnolia oil when I lotion my body I mix the two together and then it works out for me so I decided to pick out this one and then we also decided to pick out these feminine wipes from clicks this is the clicks brand it's 24 in a pack and these wipes are individually packed I really like when my wipes are individ individually packed because I can easily take about four or five and put in my bag for on the go. So that's why I decided to go for the individually packed ones. And then lastly, we just got some gum. And then moving over, moving over to pick and pay. I popped in at pick and pay. First thing I got is this pack of tissues. It's just a pick and pay brand. And then I also picked out this mouth wash, the Listerine one. They had a special, so I just decided to get it at pick and pay. And then I also picked out two energy drinks. I'm a fan of play, especially the orange one. Um, sometimes I get the purple one, but I like my orange play. So lastly, we go to my favorite pack, plastic, my favorite bag. Just kidding. So this is where everything went south. This is where everything went off budget. So I went into the skincare aisle and i noticed that pons had a 50 percent off on all the items i could have left and be disciplined but then no, i decided to indulge myself before we get into the skincare items um first thing we picked out a pack of pads um it's such a coincidence that it is the same brand as the panty liners i think moving forward i'll try to do that 
use the same brand I think the last time I used this brand it was in high school high school days but in my adult life I haven't used this one so I was picking out my regular brand my regular um, pack but I decided to rather switch to this one I don't know why and also this one is uncensored uncensored important so first things first and then I just picked out this pack of wet wipes from Huggies. I also couldn't decide between the two, but then I decided to go for these ones because I needed wet wipes after doing number two. Toilet paper is not enough for after doing number two. Yeah. And then I also picked out some toothpaste. So this time I went for this one. I wanted to try out this one. So it's like I'm trying out new things in this haul. So yeah, I'm trying out this one. And then let's move over to the skincare, skincare items. First things first. First time trying out this Pons Micellar Water. I've been a Garnier fan for the longest time. I've been using Garnier micellar water. But then because this one was 50% off and lately in my skincare I've been using Pons. I decided let me try out this micellar water and see how I'm liking it. Now when it comes to micellar water, my Garnier doesn't irritate my eyes. It doesn't burn my eyes. I just hope it doesn't irritate my eyes and it doesn't burn my eyes so secondly i went with my serum face creams so this is what i use on an everyday basis when i moisturize my skin i use it along the johnson's one so i mix these two together sorry and then i also add a serum when i moisturize my face so these ones normal price is 50 rand and i got them for 25 rand each so i decided to just pick out two now for 25 rand i could have gotten two more you never know i might go back because the special is up until the first week of march so you never know I might go back so the last two items is also moisturizing cream and gel so I've been wanting to try out this line the flawless radiance line and then the 50% off sale came and I'll be trying it out so this one is the hydrating day gel and this one is the moisturizing day cream so i decided to buy these two different ones so that i can see how i'm loving them how they work on my skin and how the consistency is with the two um with the two items so this is a gel this one is a cream I want to see how I'm liking each one. So I really cannot wait to try out these moisturizing items. Even though the first item top of the list that I wanted when I saw the deal, I wanted the serum. I've been wanting to try out the Pond serum um, in the Flor Flawless Radiance line. But then, as you saw, they didn't have any stock. So I want to check another disc came or online because if it's 50% off, then I can buy two serums. I want to try and see if I can do that. If I can, you will see in my next uh, daily vlog. I'll just do that in a daily vlog. And yeah, these are all the items I decided to pick out. Uh, my day was successful. I really enjoyed vlogging again and vlogging shopping for hygiene items i really hope you enjoyed this vlog thank you so much for watching um 
I will see you in my next video. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share the video and also turn on your post notification bell so that you get notified every single time I upload a new video. I will see you in my next upload.